Now, let's click the Terms tab to set up your terms for the year. All terms for each school year are configured here. The terms contain the individual classes or courses. In this example, we'll use quarters, however you can configure trimesters or any other term type in a similar fashion. Be sure to specify the year as part of the term title. The report title is displayed on the report card and other reports and therefore should be abbreviated. Specify the start and end dates for just this quarter. Keep in mind that this setting will determine the days that attendance can be recorded. If this is the quarter you will be starting with, go ahead and make it active. Then, click Add. We now have our first term created. It's a good idea to go ahead and finish configuring terms for the rest of the year. If your school displays semester averages on the report card, you will need to create what we call a parent term. Enter an appropriate title in the term title field. Again, in the report title field, be sure to abbreviate it so everything fits properly on the report card. You don't need to make this term active. Simply click Add. Now, select Quarter 1 from your list. On the drop-down menu for parent term, Choose Semester 1 of this school year. Then click Submit Changes. Now the quarter term is grouped into its semester or parent term. Do the same for quarter 2. Then create a term for semester 2 and associate quarters 3 and 4 with it. If your school has final exam grades which display on the report card and make up a fixed percentage of the semester grade, you can configure this in GradeLink using exam terms. In the Term Title field, enter an appropriate name such as Exam 1 2012-2013 and an abbreviated title in the Report Title field. Select the parent term from the drop-down. Then click the checkbox for Exam Term. Specify the weight your school determines. Keep in mind that for grade levels like primary grades, where the final exam may not be shown on the report card, this setting will not be applicable.